not all books are created equal. In fact, uh, I would most people would love to get letters like this. Eric, hey, we sold out of your books. Send more copies, okay? Here's the problem, folks. Jeff Bezos, he's not a bad guy. In fact, Alexis probably listening. Jeff's a nice guy. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But the point is this. KDP puts a little barcode on the back of your book that says non-returnable. What that means is, is that when Amazon is your publisher, KDP, or a lot of other self-publishers, they put on the back of your book non-returnable. And what that means is that bookstores do not want to buy your book. Because if they buy your book, the book industry allows you to send back the books if they don't sell. Does that make sense? You can send back the books if, if, if you don't sell, but not with a not with a, um, uh, a KDP book. In fact, with the KDP book, it says non-returnable. And so you might think, oh my gosh, I'm, I'm published. I'm so excited. But the problem is you go to sell that there. You go to, you go to the bookstore. They say we can't carry it. In fact, not only that, it gets worse, okay? Three reasons why you can't get into Barnes & Noble, number one, or Waterstones or Chapters Indigo, whatever is your favorite book store. There's a right way and a wrong way. I'm telling you folks, it's not KDP. It's not a lot of these other places. Why? Because you never get hardcover books. You, by the way, you want hardcover books, okay? Hardcover books are called influencer copies. They're amazing. They look good, they feel good. Anyway, you can't get those on KDP. You can't do soft cover pre-sales. Why is that important? Because it's very important to get into bestseller lists. In other words, the New York Times, the Wall Street Journal, USA Today, all these book lists count pre-sales for the first week of sales. Does that make sense? You could be selling your book six months before it launches, five months, four months, three months, two months, one month, all of those books sold before, including the first week, count for the bestseller list. So if you don't, if you use KDP, they're going to say, nope, you can't do any pre-sales. You, you can only publish the day you click publish. What's up with that? You're locked out of a lot of bestseller lists. You can't get full store, uh, glo full global distribution. Your book's not carried in many places. How Annoying is that to be on all these podcasts, interviews, all this training, and then people say, oh, I went to go buy your book. Can't get it. Not cool. You don't get foreign translation deals. Trust me, they're not going to give you foreign translation deals, and yet our authors get their books. In fact, hold on. I'm getting excited. Hang on, hang on. Here we are. I'm getting excited. Hold on. Books are falling on my head. It's all great. Look at this. Japanese or Chinese, forgive me. I think it's Chinese actually. Chinese, day job to dream job. There it is, my book in Chinese, okay? Why? Because we can get global distribution. We can get foreign translation deals, pretty slick. All right, no marketing strategy. KDP is not gonna help you with that. They just wanna get your book on their listing and then that's it. They don't care if you sell any. You can't get advanced reader copies. If you do, it has this nasty stripe across the front that says not for sale. You might say, what's an ARC copy? An ARC copy is an advanced reader copy that you send to influencers so that they can give you endorsements on future editions. You don't get your book on Nook. Why? Because Amazon's against Nook. It's like Coke and Pepsi, right? And so your book's locked out of iBooks, iTunes, expanded ebook distribution. It's not on Nook. Other things like no writing or publishing coaching from a real author, bummer. You just get a salesperson who's probably never published a book in their life, nothing against them, but they're the ones that are supposed to be quote, helping you, all right? All right, let's keep jumping in. Uh, no, no bookstore placement and it goes on and on. All right, so why can't you get your book into Barnes Noble? Because your book can't be returned, because you don't provide a wholesale discount, and because your book isn't priced correctly.